I literally just saw this guy bend his back tire on his bike. Man, aw. Oh. I'll see if he gets it. If he doesn't, I'll walk over and see. Oh, he's got it. I think he's got it. Nope, oh, someone else is helping him. Oh, that's nice. Bottom line, sometimes life throws you, um, not peaches, but lemons, right? I'll look at this guy help him. <laughs> the guy helping and then his bike falls over. Oh man, this is a spectacle. <laughs> They're just standing on it, bending it. It's You can tell the bike's been through the, through the paces. how to turn a negative into a positive. Today's vlog was a little interrupted because of a technical difficulty with Final Cut Pro. That is the video software app that I use to edit all the vlogs and basically it decided to just not export yesterday's vlog for like three hours so I was on the phone with tech support for about 45 minutes and that's a lot of time to waste. I don't like wasting time and neither do you and so anyway I'm trying to turn a negative wasting time into a positive because I was planning to film something completely different today but I don't have enough time to do that so instead I'm going to give some shout outs to all of you one to a new viewer of the vlog one to an old viewer of the vlog and then of course the comment of the week and yes we give a shout out every week to the best comment down in the comments below over the past seven days so let's start off with the new subscriber, all right? This is crazy. We have published 800 daily vlogs in a row, like 850 something, it's a lot. So, a gentleman from Nebraska, I believe Lincoln, Nebraska, and, oh, I think his name is Matthew. Yes, it's Matthew. And his handle on YouTube is Shop twilled shop twilled I'm not sure what that is in reference to exactly Matthew I forget sorry and so bottom line I want to say thank you Matthew for going back into the archive because guess what there's some really good old vlogs there's some really good ones out there right so if you want to learn more about my life and editing style and why I started a daily vlog I encourage you to go way back like Matthew has shop twilled on YouTube I appreciate it sir thank you for taking the time to comment you're amazing all right speaking of context of who I am and what I do here on YouTube. Let's give you a little more context from the sky. Did you see a difference there? Did you see a difference there? Trying some new transitions for you guys, trying to get better. All right, the comment of the week now goes to his username, or her, I'm not exactly sure, sorry, is behind OPS is the username, and they said, I'm still watching the daily vlogs because I think they make a more deep connection with the people. They're still alive, but a lot of people are afraid to fail if they do them. And listen, I just love them, and they connect with my personality as far as committing to something every single day it helps me uh, but it's not for everyone you know what I mean it's definitely not for everyone I know a lot of great youtubers and vloggers who make videos consistently but not every day so anyway that's the comment of the week another shout out for today once again trying to turn a negative situation into a positive as we uh, transition through this fine day come on You're not gonna believe this. The gentleman on the bike from earlier in the vlog, he showed up at Starbucks like two hours later, the Starbucks I was working at. He showed up walking, not on his bike. He was sweating. He was sweating profusely. I feel horrible. I feel horrible that I did not stop to help him. Folks, always stop and help others. I just, 
Somebody else was trying to help him, but I can't make excuses. No excuses allowed. I feel horrible. He just showed up, and I know it was him because I, if he had the same backpack on, and he was sweating. <laughs> Time for the third shout out at the shed. So, this last shout out goes out to a longtime viewer and somebody who faithfully comments down below and answers the question of the day. And I just love the guy and I love his YouTube channel. Um, but he said to me once, he said, Sometimes it's better for texture over polish. And what he was talking about is sometimes the vlog, it doesn't need to be fancy with fancy edits or fancy cuts or fancy music. Sometimes just the texture of life. The screaming, <laughs> the 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 hitting your elbow on the shovel, the the you know the the stumbling over my words as I'm trying to record this for you guys. Sometimes that is just as good as a clean, beautifully shot, beautifully edited, polished vlog. And so this gentleman, I think he knows who he is. Go check out his channel. It's called The Daily Damien. You spell Damien, D-A-M-I-E-N. And just check it out. And his videos are short. It's, you know, mostly videos about his family. Uh, but I just, I just think it's just, it's a good, wholesome, great vlog. And uh, he doesn't post every day, but that's okay. And he, he just makes fun little videos with his family, and I love it. I love it. So, Daily Damien, you get the shout out, the last shout out for today. And that's it, folks. We are calling it. I'm sure I forgot to tell you something, but I love you. Oh, that's what it is. I love you. I love you. And thanks to all the new subscribers. Holy guacamole, you're blowing my mind. You're blowing my mind. <sighs> Spread the word. Spread the word. We're doing it. We're going. We're going. Seek beauty. Work hard. Love each other. See you tomorrow.